Hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to the channel. It's your girl Brightest Day. I'm so excited to be back. If you're new here, welcome to this day one family. If you're an oldie but a goodie, you don't know the thing, go welcome back. So today I'm bringing a life update video. But before I get into the video, this video is in partnership with Rose Forever. They are a... Um, rose company they make like rose arrangement luxurious and like exquisite stuff you know bougie and stuff like that so if you're someone who are um who's into like roses and stuff like that i think this is a great choice um this is what the roses come in it's this black velvet box with this gold detail right here that just says rose forever it is very pretty y'all can already tell that this is some fancy stuff in here so with rose forever you can choose whatever color arrangements you want i really love the red one but at the time they didn't have it so i just went with my favorite color and y'all look 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 at this look just just look at this and this blue i didn't expect this blue i mean this is how it looks on the website so i'm i don't know why i didn't expect it to look like this but y'all y'all ever order something online and it don't look like what you thought it would look like now this is exactly what you see online the color the lighting everything is the same it's really pretty now they have different shapes you can get heart ones um bigger ones like this they have round ones as well and like I said, check out the description box for a coupon code. I got gotcha. you. I definitely think this is reasonable. One cool thing about it as well is that it lasts up to one year. Like, and I'm pretty sure it can last longer than that. You know what I'm saying? If you really take care of it and you like, you know, be very gentle. Um, it's really, really pretty. They are obviously artificial. I'm not sure if you can take them out. I'm not even going to try because I don't want to mess up the arrangement. But I think just keeping it here, like, I'm about to put it down like y'all can see. It. Just put it on your dresser, your side table, like, anywhere to match with, like, decor. And a cool thing, like I said, they have different colors for you to match any schemes that you have throughout your house or office or anywhere you would like to put this. Um, and I just want to say, again, thank you to Rose Forever for reaching out to your girl. I really do appreciate y'all should definitely go ahead and check them out. And... Look in the description box for a coupon code, sis. So now we're about to jump in into what y'all are here for, which is a life update, a QA, and a all of that. Where is Brightest Day? Where has she been? What am I up to? All of that things is here in this video for you. So the last time you actually saw me or anything related to videos, you know, I was in Jamaica. Y'all saw my grandpa, my grand my grandfather came up with my, my brother. They both came up. They were here for, um my grandfather was here for a while and then a lot of people would reach out and ask me about my two little cousins who were always in my Jamaica vlogs. They weren't in the last one. A lot of people were like, where's Tanil and Q? So Tanil and Q migrated to the U.S. almost a year now. So that's why y'all didn't see them in my recent Jamaica vlogs and stuff like that. Um, so yeah, but luckily they came i went and got them for about a month or maybe like a month and a half they were staying here they came to visit my grandfather and stuff like that <laughs> where is, where is <laughs> yeah i name full boss you're going to fall off if you see a boy. Why you get a little cute? Watch out. Um, we had a really good time. The the reconnection and everything was good. Um, it just felt like home again. I feel like I really love having a bunch of family around. I never thought that, but like having it and seeing, I'm like, oh man, this is nice. So anyway, yeah, my grandfather stayed um, for a while, then he left and went back. What do you have to say? I'm going to tomorrow morning, right? Mm -hmm. Shop, come up with you. See you like next two years, right? Mm -hmm. Now come back to the park. Yeah. Are you going to miss everybody? Sure. Yeah, man, I miss everyone. Yeah, I miss you especially, not you. Yeah, but. What makes you think it's so special? I don't know. Sleep on me, What do you have to say? Anyway, nothing else? Hey, don't care about anything, man. 
No matter how you go, you say, you know, you know, you know, you know, you know, you know, you miss me. know, you know, you know, you know, you know, I'm going to sleep so late. What do you have to say? Are you going to miss your grandfather? Yeah. What else? No, we don't go. Adrian, what do you have to say? Tiro, you have to say. We have to say TT. Say something, Miss Papa. Yeah. Who has something to say? Yeah, yeah, but, uh, yeah, well. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, well. And then my cousin stayed for a little bit as well. Thank you. Thank you. Happy birthday to you. How old are you now? How old are you now? One, two, three. 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 Good job. Good job. All right. And then they went home and then reality started. I started work. Um, I started going into the building. We are teaching online. So I started going to the building just to like, you know, separate that work from home. Because I don't know about you. I love going into work for the fact that when I leave work, I'm actually coming home. So anyway, I'm back in my school today. Um, this, we don't have to come back. But I need a balance between work and home so i decided to come here even though we're done with our meetings for today i just gotta finish up some stuff and i gotta print attack this printer anyway look at my classroom y'all just like i left it last time we saw it everything was packed up here but look at this we're back but well, we're not back but look at these floors though i can see my whole reflection i was struggling a little bit when it comes to when it came to working from home because I feel like I wasn't separating work and home. I feel like I was always working. And I don't like this. It's, it's a boundary. Like, the, especially now where people don't make them more of a red kill. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Anyway, so yeah, I started working. Been teaching online since August. No, since September. Started working in August. Um, Teaching online is, y'all... <sighs> it's not it. <laughs> but... Um, I'm pushing through it definitely got better over time, but I do miss my student I miss the interaction with students are not the same the engagement isn't the same as well It's so many factors to teaching online that I don't really like um, but I understand it's a pandemic So obviously um, people have to be safe and all of that um they intended for us to start school like going into the building in november obviously that didn't work out um now it's pushed back to january so that's why a lot of y'all who follow me on instagram and on snapchat saw that your girl took that opportunity and i was out <laughs> i went to jamaica for about six weeks five to six weeks originally it was only supposed to be well first of all obviously i never go to jamaica at this time so it was not planned so after I started working, I noticed that we weren't going back to work. I heard November, so I was like, okay, my birthday is in October. Let me go. Y'all know Sweets is there. My grandparents is there. I always love being around my grandparents. And then Sweets is like a bonus, duh. Sweets' birthday and I, I, my birthday is like a day apart. So I was like, okay, let's spend our birthday together. So I went down October 9th and did the whole, you know, everything. I started vlogging on the travel vlog that day. But when I got to Jamaica... Um, you know, I was still working, so it's still like, it's not your usual Jamaica trip where I was, um, where I was really, you know, free. I was still like working and stuff like that. And I decided like, hey, I'm not even, I'm around sweets most of the time and y'all know I don't put him really in the vlogs. And I hate... I don't know if y'all hate it, but I do. I don't like vlogging him and blocking his face out. Like, what's the point of putting him in a video in the first place? But, I mean, I've done it before, but I just decided that's something that I don't want to do. I'm not saying that I'm not, I'm going to block out his face for all the time. But I'm not going to introduce anybody on my channel until I'm like, you know, sure, sure. Not saying I'm not sure, so sweets, don't get mad. I'm just saying, like... You know, when the time is right, it'll happen. But I'm not hiding him. I feel like I'm getting... A 
I'm gonna get into that because I'm getting a lot of questions about like long distance relationship but the hate is real y'all and I'm just a la la land person so like I never expected people to like be inboxing me some crazy stuff and it's just not one person you know what I'm saying so it's just like whoa all right let me keep that part of my life like tucked away and I want to enjoy it and stuff like that and then the other thing why I wasn't vlogging in Jamaica was just because it was raining I spent five almost six weeks in Jamaica and y'all it rained for like all that time except maybe five days we had like sun where it didn't rain at all and we actually could go out and do stuff which i didn't mind so it was a lot of staying in and stuff like that um when i was there but yeah that's all i've been up to for my life so y'all gonna do my pan camera put it in your back y'all going too much mm-hmm Cool. yeah guys so that's such like a big like story time in a sense of what i've been up to that's the life update as far as work obviously i'm in the same job and everything like that uh, yeah so nothing much has changed that much it's just like we're in a pandemic so everyone is adjusting to that and everything like that uh, my mom is good my brother is good a lot of people have been asking how he's um adapting to the whole american lifestyle i'll answer that when i get to the q a portion of it but that's as much as what's been going on y'all the big change of my life my last life update till now is that i had recently moved to philly moved back to philly so I'm, st I'm still in philly um i'm now a god mom <laughs> that's new as well and say hi <laughs> say hi everybody uh, my name is laura and also now i'm in a relationship so that's like the biggest change from the last um life update so guys i decided to do the q a portion of this video separately because i had a lot of questions and i didn't want this video to be too long so i'll see you in the q a part of this video thanks so much for watching if you enjoyed this video definitely go ahead and go ahead and thumbs it up and i'll see you guys in my next one bye guys if I want to, I want to come down to the